Welcome, welcome, welcome to another episode of Bonsai Craft. As I zoom in real close to my face, uh, I got myself in a bit of a pickle here. <laughs> you see, up there, way up there, is a giant hole. Because I got the smart idea to actually dig out all the bricks from the inside of the four by or the two by two pillars. Um, I hope this doesn't screw anything up. Okay, this is where I want. <laughs> yeah, that being said, uh, I, I keep falling down them because I haven't actually capped them off yet. But that's not exactly what we planned on doing in today's episode. We actually planned on finishing this build. All we have left to do is throw a roof on this floor and actually design the roof to this building and we can call it officially done. I'm super excited. It has been a long project, long in the running. We need to finish the elevator still, but that's fine. That'll come in a minute here. We're just waiting for our bees to produce more honey so we can actually do that, uh, which from the looks of it, they're hard at work there. So I'll be happy to see what they come up with. Um, so yeah, we got some blocks of quartz here. We actually need to fly down here and smelt these guys up into some smooth quartz. Now, the trick is, do I already have smooth quartz? No, I don't, but I have plenty of this. Um, we're gonna need some of this. We have a singular block of quartz. Oh, we're gonna need so much more than that. So we're gonna take two stacks here. We're gonna convert them into blocks. What is it, a full? Nope, it's just a four by four. You know, I've done this crafting recipe so many times, you think I'd know what it is, but I don't. All right, there we go, we got 19. We'll give each one of those a piece of coal, slap it in the furnace, and by golly, next thing you know, it'll be ready to go. <laughs> that was probably really loud, I apologize. I'm gonna be a mouthy one today. It doesn't help the fact I got a new set of headphones and it's kind of a challenge to hear myself, but that's perfectly fine with me because Hey, you know what? The sound quality is real good. Um, what else do we need to get this done? We can actually probably start working on the exterior balcony here because we know that's gonna be separate from everything else. So let's see what we have for blocks. Uh, we don't have that many of these blocks. That might be a conundrum. All right, let's do this. Let's go back downstairs. I love those slime blocks. Come over here to the stone cutter. Slap these guys in here. Let's get at least a stack here. Maybe a little bit more. There we go. Let's see how far that gets us going around the outside here. And then... If we can find some more smooth stone, I would like to get that going too. Um, for now, I might have to actually just spend some time gathering resources and making sure we got all our ducks in a row before we can actually crack on to building this thing and getting it all said and done. So I might get that stuff around, make sure I've got everything I need, and I'll catch you guys possibly with a time lapse if not just an update and then maybe a time lapse who knows we'll play with it but for now let's get off to the rest of the episode all right guys uh here's the scoop i was going to do a third person time lapse of this using my new camera account i'd love to use that more often actually but i decided not to because I want to get as much done in this episode as I can, which means I'm probably going to be doing some very large jump cuts. I will apologize for that, but you know, I'm already missing a day and so I figured I'd talk to you guys about something real quick. Uh, the reason I didn't upload a video yesterday, quite simply put, up until last night at like 10 o'clock at night, I had been paying for a server. Now, I had no issue with that when our server was smaller, but our server got a little bit bigger and a little bit more resource intensive. And because of that, I was going to need to pay to upgrade our server. 
and I really didn't feel like doing that because I'll let you guys know a little hint here, I am relatively good with computers, so I decided to take it upon myself to figure out how hard it is to actually make a Minecraft server. And as of right now, I'm actually currently playing on a Minecraft server running on my own computer, and I tried it out with a few of the bonsais, mainly the original four of us, and oh that's an issue, there's an enderman up there. Um, anyways, I tried it out, and it turns out that it actually works pretty good, so I think that's the route that I'm gonna go, is running my own server. Now, because of that, it does mean I didn't get a chance to upload, because I've been really busy setting that up. Um, and along that same lines, I know this has been multiple weeks now that I missed my upload date of Thursday, and I feel bad because I keep doing that, so here's what I was thinking of doing instead. Instead of trying to force myself to get a video out every Thursday, which as of right now has been a serious challenge to do, I think I would like to change my upload schedule to something that's a little bit more doable, especially in this time where everything is rapidly changing and rapidly evolving. Um, if you guys are okay with it, and I mean, no offense, but I feel like you kind of have to be since it's kind of my executive decision here. I wouldn't mind changing my upload date to Fridays and maybe still keeping with the Bonsai Bud episodes because I think you guys really like those episodes and I know I really like filming them, but I'd like to even change that date. So instead of that being on Tuesdays, that will now be on Wednesdays. I'm choosing these days as recording days because my class schedule, especially in this time of online learning, is really busy on Monday, or it, not on Monday, it's really busy on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I don't want to upload anything on Monday just because it's Monday and I know that I'll drag my feet too much if I try to do that. Um, and so... That's kind of where I was thinking of heading, and here we are on Friday. Today will be the first day that I'm going to try to do that. Hopefully I can actually get this video done and uploaded by then. Uh, and you know, hopefully we can actually get a lot of progress done before that time happens. Because it's currently... What time is it? It is 11.29. I want to get this video out to you guys by 4 like I usually do. Which, that's the other thing. I think that I'm going to stop putting myself on a time constraint as to when my video needs to be uploaded by. I think I'm just going to stick to telling you guys, hey, videos are going to go live on Friday. But I am going to try to make sure I get them out to you guys as close to 4 o'clock as I can, just because I know 4 is kind of a decent time to get a video out. Uh, and I'd like to know what your comments are on that. Um, on the same note as that, I know I ask you guys to leave comments a lot, and I know I don't get a lot of comments back. I do just want to throw out there one more time, I did it in the Bonsai Bud episode last week, but I did actually get my Discord server up and running, it's working, it's there, uh, it just needs- oh this is going to be a serious issue, okay I need to light this place up. It just needs people in it, and that is the next step I think, is getting you guys to actually be able to join that. Um, I told you last week I was going to link it in the video, and I found out I cannot do that because I don't have the ability to do that through YouTube. However, I can link it in the description. So if you guys look in the description of this video, it'll be right there. I might even see if I can try and post on social media and get the word out just a little bit more. I hope you guys are interested in joining that because I put a lot of effort into it and I think it's going to be a really cool idea if it gets utilized. But that's where it comes down to you guys too is it's got to get utilized. If no one's using it, if no one's being active, then it just kind of goes to waste. And that's not necessarily what I'm after. I'm trying to use this as a way for you guys to be able to communicate with me, to be able to talk and enjoy having some fun and messing around. And we are gonna go light up the area above us. 
so that way we do not have mobs galore. Because there's already one too many mobs up here, and there's only one. <laughs> All right, um, I think with that being said, I'm actually gonna make my first jump cut right here because I don't know how long I've been recording. And like I said, I wanna get a whole bunch done. I wanna basically have this entire resort finally finished by the end of this episode. We don't actually have that much left to do, believe it or not, we're on the home stretch here. So that being said, I'm gonna jump cut. I'll come back possibly after I get the ground level of this next floor done. Hopefully that'll be where I'm at, is getting the ground level done. So, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Here we have it, ladies and gentlemen. I am really happy to say this. Uh, this floor actually looks really cool, and I was going to put some carpet around here, but honestly I might just leave it, because I kind of really like the looks of this white. It kind of really makes this floor stand out, especially since it's really empty in the sense that this is supposed to be a business room. I might actually go grab some lecterns and put a couple lecterns around here, maybe get like eight of them with books. So if we wanna write anything down, we can jot it down and leave it here. But no, I actually like the way this floor looks. Now, the catch 22 is I don't wanna take these elevators all the way up. And so we need to find a new way to get access to the roof. I was thinking of actually maybe putting something right here along the lines of like a simple ladder. I know it's kind of old school, but you know, I thought that'd be fine. Um, as far as the roof goes, we do have some work to do here. Uh, I need to actually go back to my base, grab some dirt and fill in this area to kind of level it out. And I need to plan some things out in my head because I have something I want to do that is going to be very special up here to finish this build off. But, it's going to take some thinking and some kind of out of the box styling, but I'm very excited for it and very, 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 very excited to finally be able to say I'm done with this build and the community project will have been finished. Uh, until then though, um, I'm gonna go look and see why it looks like, ah, see. There was a slight optical illusion there going on where I was standing there and I could see that block, but it lined up like perfectly like that. So it looked like for some reason there was a fifth block, but there's not. So that's all good. <laughs> now that I went on a little side tangent, I'm going to fly back over to my other base, grab the stuff I need, come back here and hopefully be able to show you guys what I'm planning in my next cut. Uh, so, slight setback, um, as you guys can tell, I am not wearing any armor right now, and I also am about 34 levels less than the last time you guys saw me. Um, so I popped over to my base to grab some more supplies so I could finish up the resort it was coming along quite nicely. I was making some good progress and we were actually really close to getting it done. But when I popped over to my base, it was kind of a mob fest and I, I died. Um, I lost all my stuff. I don't know where it went and I'm currently using all my backup gear. Thankfully, I did have some backup gear, although it's all really crappy stuff because it's backup gear. So we've got an Unbreaking 3 and Fire Aspect 2 Sword. I do have a Silk Touch pick, but it's pretty well dead, so I need to go fix that. We had a Shovel. Um, I did actually have another good bow, thank God. Uh, in terms of armor though, we have a Feather Falling pair of boots, Protection 2 and Unbreaking pants. I do have an Elytra with Mending and Unbreaking and a helmet with projectile protection and aqua affinity. This gear is actually the stuff that I was supposed to use to go to the end and do end busting with. Granted, it needed a few more enchantments, but it wasn't something I planned on using this early. Um, 
Unfortunately, it does kind of mean we're halted on our progress in this episode, because I don't have the tools or the supplies that I need, because I lost them all. So, here's what we're going to do. I think instead of me trying to grind out another like two hours of this and pushing this video out to you guys later than it already is, I think I'm just going to call this episode here, but I'm going to call this part one. Part one of us finishing the resort and getting it all set and done. And I'm going to try and get part two out to you guys as soon as possible. Uh, maybe Wednesday at the latest, get it out to you guys by Wednesday at the latest. Instead of doing a bonsai bud, do a secondary bonsai craft. Hopefully I can even get it out to you before the end of the weekend. But I think that's what I want to do. I think I want to call it here. I want to give myself some time to kind of recover, build myself back up a little bit, and gather the remaining resources we need. It's not that this is what I want to be doing, but it's kind of the situation I'm in because I'm already crunched on time because it's currently like 2.30, I haven't done any editing, and I don't have anywhere near the supplies that I need to get this done. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this Bonsai Craft episode. I did have fun making this episode, even if I did die, uh, <laughs> and you know, at the end of the day, I think I learned something out of this episode. One. I think I learned that I need to make my uploading days on Friday, and two, I learned just because I have good gear does not mean I am invulnerable. Not even close. <laughs> I mean, I knew that, but how I died just made me sad because I should have known better. I kind of just kind of fell to my death. Um, but yeah, that being said, I'm gonna... I'm going to call this episode here, and I'll catch you guys next time. See ya.